hi everyone welcome back to my channel the mk lady well i decided to do something a little different for this unboxing video because i'm gonna do a two-in-one combo again i'm gonna do the unboxing but first i'm going to do the winner's haul because like i said in this afternoon's video i do have I did get stuck in Winners last night, so why not pick up some items from Winners? So I decided to change my outfit. Now, I did put on these shorts. I got these tie shorts from Joe Fresh, and I forgot to show you these sandals. So these are just some regular normal slides from Joe Fresh as well. So I got these ones in the mail uh, about a month or two ago. So they came with the shorts and I thought, you know, it's nice with this white striped with this camel color and then the shoes. And there is a reason why I changed my outfit. It is because what is inside for the Michael Kors unboxing. So we will get started we'll start with the winner's haul now this is the unboxing we'll come back to it but as you could see the color right there so we'll come back to that we'll go start with the winner's haul my outfit again i just love these shorts and remember i got the po polka dot shorts so that is the shorts from joe fresh the whole outfit is actually from Joe Fresh. So we are just gonna go to, oh, I guess I should turn on some lights here, to the kitchen. So I cleared all the Dollarama stuff and then I put all of the Winners stuff that I picked up, which is a lot. But at Winners, you know if you see something, <laughs> You need to grab it because, um, and there's my dog Miko. Hi Meeks. Hi Miko. Dusty is sleeping. It's his nap time. He sleeps 23 hours a day. So that's why you're not seeing him in this video. So this contraption is for my bathroom and it's a two in one deal and I needed a new one. So this one is so cool. It was $29. So it is a plunger and you just put it in like that. And then here is the cleaning brush for the toilet, $29. And the company is Good Gripes. Now that is gonna go in my bathroom. So I also started opening this and actually this is, let's see it's turned around, it is, a shower squeegee and this one was for $9.99 so you hook this on your shower and then hook it on there on the the walls and you can clean your shower after you're done showering our old one was falling apart so I thought why not get a new one I needed a new towel ring $12.99 I needed a new shower holder and this one was for $14.99 and the thing about this one is that it has these kind of different hooks and it also has in the packaging some suction cups so that's what I really like. Now we're getting into the good fun stuff. So I got this kind of, it's like a plasticky. I guess you would say, well, it's called Mr. Barbecue Triangle Grill Brush. Four bucks on clearance. We'll get into my stuff in a minute. So my husband needed some new sunglasses and these were in the clearance for 60 bucks and they are your standard Ray-Ban sunglasses and he loves Ray-Ban so picked him up some cute kind of Wayfair sunglasses he likes them a lot also found some shoes now these were just taken out so they were 39 and these are the fish and chip shoes 
I got for my son. And then I also got my husband some fish and chip brown shoes, but these were for 30 and then those were 39 because those came out at a, like these ones were older than those ones is what she told me because I was like, shouldn't they be both $30? So now we're going to get into the good stuff, my stuff. So I picked up these scrunchies, you know, in the 90s and the 80s, you use them for hair, $5.99. And then I picked up these nail products. So I already opened this one, ripped it apart, and then taped it back together. So the Orly base coat. And then the Siche Vite, Vite. This is a top coat, quick drying. And then China Glaze Gotta Go top coat, $4.99. And then China Glaze nail polish, just in the basic pink. Now, I've been hearing a lot, a lot, a lot about this is MAC, MAC products. You can't see because it's glaring. Oops. Let's see if I can get that. Nope. It won't glare. But there, there is four lipsticks in there. And this one was for $16.99. I've heard a lot about MAC, so I wanted to give them a try. Now, I got two of these, but I only have one in the picture, but this is the Lavender Mint Hand Wash Elixir for $6.99, and they're quite nice size bottles. Uh, let's see, 532 mils, so that's good for the bathroom. I did need some new purple shampoo by this company called Gold, Goldwell Dual Senses, so blondes and highlights. $24.99 shampoo and conditioner so I thought I'd give that a try I haven't heard of that company before now this is something new this one is one of those magnetic charcoal masks so this one it's supposed to be really good I seen it on Facebook $6.99 so it's by the company Danielle so that is all that I got in terms of my winner's shopping haul. So pretty excited for those. Now I did actually pick up some items, clothes items for myself. I didn't find any shoes, so that's a good thing. I got enough shoes. Now I'm gonna show you in my closet here open up here so I got these four items but I will show you when I put the camera back on the tripod right there so I'm back and I just had to set up my camera on the tripod 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 did I say that in the last section of the video tripod not tripod and I do have the Michael Kors unboxing from Winners, but I did want to show you some cute clothes that I found at Winners as well. So remember I was saying that these shorts were from Joe Fresh. Here are the camel white polka dot ones. I think they were for $29. So wanted to show you those. Now they are having a lot of their items on clearance. So regular $16.99 clearance, $8, and that's a cute little polka dot summer shirt. And the next shirt, this one is just a yellow basic kind of dress shirt with the different sleeves, the poofy sleeves a little bit. And so this one was $24.99 on sale for $12 and it's a stretchy material and you already seen this DKNY dress I don't have my new hangers these are my old ones so this one was for $59 on sale for $30 and it's regular $109 so that is a good deal and I think my favorite one, and I can't wait to wear it, is this beautiful 
summer dress with the frill at the bottom. Calvin Klein. Now it was $59 on sale for $30. And I believe the tag said it was for, I want to say a hundred and something, but isn't that just pretty? I think it's going to look so pretty when I wear it. So those are the clothing items. Now, let's get into the Michael Kors unboxing. I am using my Dollarama. This is not um, dishwasher safe, so I have to be careful when I'm washing it. But this company from Dollarama, it says ethically made and do not microwave hand wash. The company is called Aladdin. So it has this little handle here and then you can stick this part into your vehicle cup holder. So that's why I like this one. So now we shall move on. It feels like my camera's kind of sideways, but we'll keep going. So I only added this dust bag because it just gives it more of an effect so it actually usually the bags from winners do not have dust bags uh the michael kors because i don't know if they're deletes or what happens to the dust bags but i never find a dust bag at winners so this is a different type of unboxing because i have not seen this style before it is in the color luggage and it is this jacquard or I don't know how you say it but it is this MK gold kind of material with kind of the canvas and luggage straps with the gold hang tag. It's not very big. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Tory Burch. It does have the gold tone hardware. So we'll go ahead and get started. There is actually feet. So I'm, I'm happy about that. And it's a pretty light structured but unstructured bag. So it was for $2.29 at Winners. And this one is called the Griffin. And it's the camel and luggage medium satchel it says bg there but i'm not sure what bg means it says it was for 3.98 so we'll go ahead and take a look at the inside it does have this long adjustable strap as you can see it matches my top and it does have this slip pocket as well as this zip pocket right here so I'll just zip it up. So the two D rings are on the side of the purse right here. So we'll just go ahead and hook that on. But isn't that cute? The Griffin satchel or Griffin kind of tote. So I thought, you know, with the brown and the brown and all the browns even my shoes are brown my michael kors watch is brown it looks super cute so let's see what can what it can fit i'll grab my measuring tape and then you can see the dimensions now the weirdest things pop up at winners and i have not seen this bag before it has a nice handle drop there so on the bottom of the bag it's not very big at all on the bottom is 11 but it does get wider at the top so the top stretches to about 14 and then on the depth is about 4.5 right here and about 2 because it narrows in at the top let's just stick that in there so you can see it's not a very wide purse it's a narrow purse and that's what i like about it and let's see top to bottom we'll do the height is only at a nine so it's like this material i forget what they call it 
but I do like that material. So it's it's not a bad size at all. There is no slip pockets on the front or the back. So we'll go ahead. I just wanted to show you. Now I put my iPad in my room. So a regular size magazine could fit in there. And the Hunger Games book. That one can fit in there nice and comfortably. And there is room for my wallet and my wristlet confetti pink coach and my sunglasses. Oops, forgot my phone. So we'll put my phone in the slip pocket so all that stuff can fit. Now, can it zip up? That is the question. And the material is very lightweight. And there you go. It zips up perfectly, all that stuff. I mean, it's heavy because the book and the magazine, it looks nice on the crook of your arm. And let's see what it looks like with the shoulder. On the shoulder, it looks super cute. And I'd be a little worried with this material rubbing because it's not a leather, it's a fabric, but I'll have to be super careful. And it might be able to go crossbody as well if I say lengthened. Put these down actually. I can put the I guess, yeah, it's kind of big for crossbody, but it can be, and I do have a lot of stuff in there. Let's see what it would look like if I take all the magazines. So maybe for traveling, it's not, it's not as big as the Jet Set Tote. It's, it's slightly smaller than the Jet Set Tote, but not by much. It's just a tad smaller. So I think, yeah, if I'm not carrying all that stuff inside of it, it can be a good crossbody if I need it to be hands-free or something. So yeah, I don't have anything like this, especially in the gold MK. I do have, I don't know if you can see the white uh, navy monogram right there. But I don't have a gold monogram. This is super cute and I was so surprised that I actually found it. And sometimes Winners gets different items that I don't even know, like, we never see items like this at our Winners because it's super tiny Winners. So I do like it. So please, 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 Give this video a thumbs up because you know it helps in the YouTube ratings. You know it helps my channel, helps my videos get out there, helps me find you, you find me, and all that fun stuff. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, The MK Lady. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell because every time I upload a video, you will get notified. Have a great day. Bye.